Hi, cool. I'm Dan. Welcome to Two Minute Tuesdays. I'm joined by my colleague uh, Graham. I want to share with you some of the cool, exciting things that we found recently when playing with uh, Teams in the Surface Hub. So I always thought that uh, Teams was a great experience on mobile and on uh, desktop, but we've also launched a new version where you can access Teams in a web browser. So Graham, how have we uh, how have we got this rocking here? It's really easy. So we've we clicked on Start. We go into the Microsoft Edge Edge browser. And then we log in with our credentials when we go to portalboffice.com and then we click on Teams. So we get all the functionality that we do if you're using a desktop today. And the cool thing is, is you can click on the Meet Now button within your channel. Wow. We can already see a preview of our video. So we're just using the cameras on the Surface Hub here. Just make sure that we're, yeah, okay, I think yeah. we're ready. Yeah, it's looking good, we're ready to go. <laughs> um, we give it a title, uh, Project X, that sounds cool, right? That sounds really cool and then meet now. So what that's going to do is notify everyone within the team cool. that the meeting has started, they can see how long that meeting has been running for, who's in the meeting, and then we can even do things like chat. We can use the whiteboard, for example. So if we bring that up, here's some ideas that we were working on earlier, and maybe we need to, to maybe publish this. And one thing I found recently, which is really cool, yeah. was whilst we're working on this, and let's say we're sharing screen content like we're, like we're doing here, or if we're talking about some other things that we're doing, we can quickly press the crop button there and actually take a screenshot. And then Graham can then highlight the bit of the screenshot that matters. Yeah, back of my head. Back of the head, yeah, looking great. And then what we can do is then start annotating on this. And we can then snap as we go through our meeting on, on the, uh, the Teams call here in real time, <laughs> um, which is awesome and really powerful stuff. So once we've finished our meeting, what do we do with the notes? Because we've had a great meeting here today. Exactly. So if you want to jump back to over to the team and the channel a second, if you click on the ellipsis. Ah, right. Yeah, we wonder what those little dots did. That's it. Great. So I've got access to a few things here. And one of them is an email address. Yeah, so we can email back. directly into the team or into the channel. That's awesome. So, I'm sure so if you copy that there. side, I can hit the share now button on all of our notes. Right. Hit email and then copy and paste that email address you just had. So if we paste that some real-time collaboration here, Graham. Exactly. And the cool thing about this is it's not just capturing the picture of the notes, right. but also going to send the OneNote file into that team as well. Wow. So, so people can go in and edit it. Cool. So I can add that to my OneNote in my team. Wow. That is epic. Amazing. That is amazing. Fantastic. One other thing that uh, Graham noticed as we were getting ready for this session was the fact that we've now got calling also in the browser. So this is my demo tenant here. It's a general release demo tenant, nothing secret and uh, advanced showing here. We've actually got the full Cloud PBX um, available to us in the browser. So I've got my phone number here for my desk phone. I've got access to my voicemails if I had any in my calling history. All from the browser, so I'm able to join meetings again using my Surface Hub wherever I am. Exactly. Power of, power of uh, Teams. Thanks Built for watching. Teamwork. Thanks for watching.